In our health alert tonight, a major medical breakthrough. Scientists in Israel have printed a 3D heart. And despite its small size, this technology could potentially be used to fight the number one leading cause of death for American men and women, and that's heart disease. Our chief health editor, Dr. Partha Nandi, joining us now to show us what makes this discovery so special. Doc. So Glenn, the 3D hearts really have been printed in the past, but they were simple tissues and didn't contain blood vessels and, and hearts need blood vessels in order to live and function. So that's what makes this technology so amazing. It's now possible to 3D print an entire heart complete with cells, ventricles, chambers and blood vessels. Now the 3D printed prototype is quite small, measures about two and a half centimeters. Now that's the size of a rabbit's heart, so not very big. It took about three hours to print and the researchers are estimating it would take about a day to print a human heart. So really cool stuff. So when you say print, Dr. Nandy, what does that mean? Like, what are these hearts made of? So, well, Glenda, the heart is made from human cells. And what happened was that scientists took fatty tissue and separated them into cellular and non-cellular components. And then they reprogrammed these cells to become stem cells. And these stem cells then turn into heart cells. Now, the 3D printer needs what we call ink, right, quote, unquote. And this ink is made up of patient-specific biological materials. There are substances made of sugars and proteins that are then turned into a gel. And using the patient's biological material is really quite important because this reduces the chance the body will reject the organ. So, doctor, how will this be able to fight heart disease? And probably most importantly, are we actually replacing the heart? Well, Alan, it's possible that full heart transplants could happen down the road. However, it's more likely that this technology would first be used to patch diseased hearts, but we're really getting ahead of ourselves. First, the researchers need to develop the printed heart further, but I tell you, this is really amazing, and, and we'll stay on top of it and let the viewers know uh, when there's more, more coming on the, down the road. Yeah. Truly amazing stuff. Dr. Nandy, thank you for joining us. Of course. If you have a question or health concern for the good doctor, email him at drnandy at askdrnandy.com. Send it to us, Facebook, Twitter, we'll get it right to him.